Hey, it's Maria Marino for a taste of New York at the beautiful Pogan Pole Kitchen Showroom downtown. We've invited Master Chef Latino contestant Ingrid Pereira to show us some recipes using selections from a company out of Ecuador called Bonita Gourmet. So excited. Ecuador boasts abundant flavors and is one of the richest countries in terms of biodiversity. Its extraordinary geographic location allows for a variety of flora and fauna to thrive. As a result, Ecuador is known worldwide for growing delicious and superior quality produce like the famed Bonita Gourmet product line. Their products include chocolates, coffee, spreads, and sauces, with ingredients and flavors as exotic as Ecuador itself. Bonita Gourmet believes in delivering indulgent, high-quality ingredients that reflect the diversity of Ecuador's delicious flavors. All right, Chef Ingrid, you have a couple recipes to show us. Yes. Which one are you starting with? Okay, so we're starting with the uh, passion fruit coolie shrimp in a chiote butter with a garlic cauliflower puree. Mm, it's going to be good. really good. Yeah, it sounds good. <laughs> so you're using this product here, correct? Yes, we're using the spicy passion fruit coolie from Bonita Grumet, and it actually is really concentrated flavor, so it's delicious. It's going to go really well with the dish. So what I didn't realize, and many people probably don't realize, this is a passion fruit. This is what they look like. And there are more than this entire bowl fitting in this little bottle because it's so concentrated. This bottle actually fits about 15 of these passion fruits. So let's get started. I have ingredients here as a butter. I have a chiote seeds, salt, pepper. We're gonna need a little bit of vegetable oil. I have a pot here, so we're gonna start with the butter. So I need this medium heat. Okay. Should be okay. So I just put the butter. So we're gonna use achiote seeds. Oh. This achiote seeds is actually a spice that is really commonly used as a base of many Ecuadorian dishes. So we're gonna just add the achiote seeds. It's gonna give a really beautiful color. So we're gonna strain the seeds oh, from the wow. butter. So we get to have just the butter. So now we're gonna go ahead and cook the shrimp. Okay. So we need a high heat frying pan. Yes vegetable oil. So now we have, as you can see, jumbo shrimp. So this shrimp that I have here already is deveined and peeled. Okay. So now we're gonna season with salt and pepper. Snow, do it. So we're gonna sear the shrimps. And so you wanna cook it until you see around the edges it's becoming pink. So that's how you know you will get the perfect sear for your shrimp. So now, as you can see, this kitchen is already smelling shrimp. Yes. <laughs> okay, so check it out, it's almost ready. Look at this color. So you will have the achiote butter, and I need you to pour it slowly. There you go. Perfect. So we're gonna turn the shrimp the other side. There you go. When you see the smoke coming out, you know the frying pan is ready for, for, for searing. Got it. So, as you can see, they're ready. The color is perfect in both sides. I'm pairing this shrimp with a garlic cauliflower puree. It's really easy to make, really simple. The only ingredients that you need is cauliflower, butter, and milk. You put it in a pot for 15 minutes, goes to a blender, and that's it. So now we have this here shrimp. Yeah. Put the shrimp and coat it or dip it into the passion fruit. So we're gonna put one here. To the second one. Right here. So what we're gonna do right now is pour a little bit of this amazing passion fruit coolie into it. And this dish is ready. You're gonna do the best part, which is drying. Really tasty. Yes. You hit it right on the head with the flavor that is in this passion fruit. It's Definitely. just so bold and just yes. like refreshing it, yeah, and it nice. Brings, and it brings together all the flavors of, of the dish. So. Sweet and spicy all at the same time. There you go. All right, Ingrid, we are just getting started. You have an entire other dish to show us. Yeah, so we're gonna make a cilantro crusted lamb chop in a spicy sweet red pepper relish and a grilled corn summer salad. So we have a pan and this is a really bit smoking, so it's good to go. I'm gonna pour a little bit of olive oil. I have these lamb chops, as you can see, already trimmed. I'm gonna put some pepper in salt. So we're gonna start usually this part 
down. Mm. There you go. And we're gonna sear it. The more color, more flavor. Just really, really important for just to get an awesome touch. So we're gonna sear it a little bit. I love that sizzle. You see that the lentil is getting color. Right. You can see it's brown and it's beautiful. So this is right. We're gonna take the lamb chop here. So the next up here, now we have the lamb chop all sear in beautiful color. So what we're gonna do is I have Digi Master. Ooh. We're going to coat the, the lamb chop with Digi Master. Okay, the crust is really simple. You can make it at home super quick. And the only ingredients that we're going to need is panko, breadcrumbs. We have a cilantro, we have a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, and a little bit of cumin, which is a spice that we use a lot in South America, and a drizzle of olive oil. And this is good to go. And done. There you go. Look at it. It's a beautiful green color. So we're going to add the cilantro crust into a plate. So the next step, you want to do it? Yeah, okay. definitely. Just like this, so we get the crust into a Digimon Monster. So as you can see, you get this beautiful cilantro green crust. It's going to be amazing. It's going to go to the oven, 400, for around 20 minutes, 18 minutes, 20 minutes. Should be OK. So this is what it looks like after 20 minutes. Beautiful. So you get this crust. So now we're going to do the most important part, which is the spicy sweet red pepper relish. So we're going to pour a little bit here. And the flavor is going to go, it's going to pair very well with the meat. I have cilantro, I have some radish, I have some grilled corn, and a little bit of queso fresco, a little bit of olive oil. That's it. So now what we're going to do is put the lamb chop into the plate. And this is good to go. It's like the perfect bed for the lamb chop. Okay, the hardest job in the world. Mm. Wow, that is incredible. Thank you so much for being with us. Don't forget to go to her website at ahungrylatina.com. At ahungrylatina is her Instagram handle yes. as well. I know I'll be following. Thanks of again. Of course, it's been a pleasure. Thank you for having me. Open yourself up to a culinary experience like no other. Bonita Gourmet uses the most flavorful ingredients sourced from various regions in Ecuador. Their products make every meal a special occasion. For more information, visit bonitagourmet.com.